welcome to Anita's guide to simple and easy cooking. I'm Anita and today I will show you how to make super supreme pizza. So let's get started. To make our easy super supreme pizza, I've got here a pizza base which I made this morning. If you want to know how to make pizza bases, I'll put a link below. And also I've got here some grated tasty cheese, grated mozzarella cheese. I've got some pineapple which I cut into small pieces. I've got here some red capsicum, which I've cooked it with garlic and olive oil. Um, some parmesan cheese. I've got here some pepperoni, some salami, some cooked onions. What I did was finely chop my onions and cooked it with a little bit of olive oil. And I've got here finely sliced black olives. And I've got here homemade pizza sauce. And if you want to know how to make homemade pizza sauce, I'll put a link below and some diced ham. Spread your pizza sauce on the base of your pizza. Spread it evenly. Spread your parmesan cheese on the pizza sauce. And now we're gonna put our two cheeses, the tasty cheese and the mozzarella cheese. finished spreading my tasty cheese and my mozzarella cheese now I'm gonna put my onions you can put raw onions in here but I don't like my onions to be raw in my pizza so I always like to cook my onions and also my capsicum besides you can also put mushrooms here if you want and some cooked chicken if you want now I'm gonna add my cooked capsicum you can just use plain red capsicum or you can use green capsicum or you can use both Today I've just got red capsicum, so I'm just going to be using red ones. Now I'm going to add my pineapple. Now I'm going to add my salami. Now I'm going to put my pepperoni in. Now I'm going to put my olives in. Now I'm going to add my ham to the pizza. Just sprinkle a little bit more parmesan cheese, tasty cheese and mozzarella cheese on top. My pizza is ready to go in the oven. Preheat your oven at 190 degrees and if you don't have a fan forced oven, preheat it at 200 degrees and pop it in the oven for 15 to 20 minutes till the cheese has melted and it's gone nice and bubbly. My super supreme pizza is ready. Enjoy! If you like this recipe, please give it a big thumbs up. For more of my simple and easy recipes, please subscribe to my channel.